Hi everyone, welcome to Sugar Letter Diaries. I'm Kimberly. So today I just wanted to show you um, a simple toy that I made that you guys might want to make. Uh, you really don't need very many supplies for this toy and it's a fun, simple, pretty toy. So I'm going to just be showing you some videos, some short videos uh, of me assembling it. But basically all you need is three millimeter chain. So that's this chain right here. Um, a couple C links, you'll want link locks of some sort, even cut straw, we'll, we'll do straws, we'll do on that. Some charms, some zip ties to secure the dangly pieces. I used zip ties and a pony bead just because I think it looks prettier that way. Some foraging cups. Yeah, I use quite a few different types of foraging cups. I have these little ones right here that I really like. I have this little Shopkins bag that I put a butterfly on and uh, then some of these little mini mugs. So most of those supplies you'd be able to get from Jessica's Attic on Facebook. So the first thing that you're gonna do is take your three millimeter, your three millimeter chain and you're going to cut the length that you want and then you're gonna cut uh, pieces, one long piece in the middle and then each section of, of three millimeter chain pieces on each side is going to be uh, slightly shorter so that it kind of has a gradual decrease in length. And then you just add your charms to it and then in the cage you could put it on, you could hang it like this is how I'm imagining it being hung like that. Uh, you could also, you could hang it just straight down. It would just be a fun foraging item that way. But yeah, I'm, the way I'm visualizing it is it's gonna be more like a gradual thing. And you can put it on the side, on the back, on the front, wherever. So that's a really simple toy that does not take very much effort, not very much skill at all. Uh, just make sure you deburr your chain Make sure you remove any sharp pieces, run your finger across every single piece, make sure there's nothing sticking out on the charms and the chain. That's a very important step. It's very tedious, but it's really important. Sometimes I like to just grab a big thing of a three millimeter chain and while we're watching a movie or something, I just sit and deburr so that when I'm ready to make my toy, that part is all done. So I hope you guys like it. Hope this video was helpful. And I'll talk to you later.